what's up guys so it is what time is it i think it's like 2 30 actually it's like three o'clock and today is um january 17 i don't know wednesday i think you guys i'm all messed up as you can see i look a hot 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 mess it's just a situation going on here um I barely have my voice my head is killing me um, so <laughs> if you guys haven't noticed I am really really sick I started getting sick on Saturday um, after I we went to um, brunch um, and then a day party with some friends on Saturday and I could start feeling um, that I was getting something then like I felt so cold and um, my throat was starting to hurt I can just always tell when I'm about to get sick so but when I tell you guys that this is the worst cold or flu that I've ever had I swear it is horrible um, I have these like really 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 bad headaches I just feel like it's like pulsating like my veins are like pulsating in my head and then um, I was just having really bad body aches like I felt like I got hit by a car or like you know when you work out at the gym or whatever I just felt my even I still feel it now my whole body just feels so sore it's just now starting to get better like I said I started getting sick on Saturday and today is Wednesday and to be honest guys I have not even gone to work so I took off Monday thinking okay you know I'll be better Tuesday took off Tuesday and then last night um, I was gonna see like how I felt early in the morning um, to see if I could go in today but it's like the all-over achiness has gotten better it's still just kind of in my neck and shoulders um i've developed like more of a cough though and then my head it's just like killing me it just feels like it's spasming so i ended up um waking up in the middle of the night last night at like 3 a.m i was tossing and turning um my head was killing me and then um i finally took some Dayquil because I had that's all I had but then um, I don't know if Dayquil has something in it that keeps you up because I just feel like after I took it I couldn't go to sleep and so then I ended up taking a Benadryl because I just had like such a bad headache and I was just like I just want to go to sleep so then um, I kept waking up because I would be soaking wet like I had like puddles it was a whole situation guys now I'm like out of breath talking because I haven't been talking much but um anyway we just got instacart because I'm not going to the store so we ordered instacart I put the stuff away and I'm going to attempt to meal prep a little bit for the week I'm gonna put some collard greens in the um, crock pot and then I have some butternut squash with rosemary garlic and parmesan roasting in the oven right now so just wanted to check in with you guys hopefully you're doing well um i'll let you know how meal prep turns out <clears throat> so you guys i forgot to um <clears throat> excuse me i forgot to show you guys how the um butternut squash <clears throat> hmm, i forgot to show you guys how the butternut squash came out you can see it has rosemary um, right here is roasted garlic um, I put olive oil on it and red pepper flakes salt and pepper and it turned out really really good and then over here I have my collard greens going it was filled, it was filled up to the top so I couldn't stir it yet but I just have whole garlic in here pepper paprika and some sea salt and then I have um, some bone broth or chicken broth in here um, I use this brand this is just the organic chicken broth low sodium from a Whole Foods brand so now I have it on high and it's been going for about I want to say like 35 minutes or so 
So yeah, I'll probably have these cook overnight. If not overnight, then at least to maybe about midnight or something like that. It's like five o'clock right now. So yeah. So that is it. I did already have some of these with some chicken shawarma. We had Mediterranean food last night, so I took some of the leftover chicken shawarma and had some butternut squash on the side. So you guys, I wanted to show you what has been my favorite little snack lately. This is the Good Culture Organic Cottage Cheese, and this one is the mango one. Um, I got it from Whole Foods. I do believe that Target has its own brand as well. Um, but I got the mango and I got the pineapple one. And when I tell you, it's just like a nice little treat. Um, it just really does the job. It's full of protein, 17 grams, and only 9 grams of sugar. And that sugar comes just from the fruit. There's no added sugar or anything like that. Um, so yeah. Just like a really good snack a lot of protein a little bit of sugar but i've been really loving it um i'm not a big fan of like um what is it cottage cheese without like a side of fruit or something just eating it on its own is not like that exciting to me but having it mixed with this little bit of fruit makes it like really good so i've been going to this like a lot lately so i wanted to show you guys what's up guys so i am in my car headed to work yes i'm finally going back to work uh today is thursday i'm not sure i'll include the date right here um i'm not even sure of the date guys um but yeah i'm finally headed back to work i'm feeling so much better than i felt yesterday after I filmed that segment that you guys saw yesterday of me like talking about cooking and stuff, I got all of a sudden super lightheaded and nauseous. I felt like I was going to pass out. I don't know what that was all about. So my head was just throbbing yesterday. And um, for the most part, that is gone today. My throat's a little um, sore um, and a little kind of dry, as you can probably hear. But... Other than that, I'm feeling so much better. So thank God for that because my God, being sick is awful. It is awful. I'm like pleading with the Lord, like, please, Lord, don't, don't do this to me any longer. Like I cannot handle this. So the Lord heard my prayers. Thank you, Jesus. And um, it has me on my way this morning. So I am so grateful for that. Um, but yeah, so now I'm just headed to work. Um, I'm kind of upset because it's like it sucks when you use your sick time. It's like, dang, three sick days. Like, ugh. But I mean, I guess that's why you have the time for when you're actually sick. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to check in with you. I hope you're having a great day. Um, yeah, I just wanted to check in with you guys and let you and let you know that I am feeling much much better today.